So I ended my classes with two pyruvates, right? Yeah. That's what I'm gonna start. So I'd like to kind of keep a tally of everything we make. But when it comes to pyruvate, we're gonna use it. Does that make sense? Okay. We're just kind of throwing back in. So we're gonna start this process with our pyruvate. And our goal is to make acetyl-CoA. What does acetyl-CoA look like? Two carbon molecule. There's acetyl-CoA. Oh, sweet. So here's acetyl-CoA, and this is pyruvate. I'll make these in and use like the exact same. Mm -hmm. Okay? Okay. There's acetyl-CoA formation. When we do this, this C, or that carbon's falling off, right? We're stripping it away? Yeah. It's going to go find some oxygen and make what? Carbon dioxide. Ta-da! Carbon dioxide. Doesn't NAD go to NAD? Uh-huh. As well. Okay, that's what we were talking about today. And we're going to input some NAD. And that makes? What? NADH. NADH. What's like the significance of NAD? How come it's always around? It's an electron carrier. Yes. Oh, it is. Which makes this electron carrier, which is super, Both. super important. At the, in the ATC. Yeah, because he's going to yield how many ATP? Three. Three. Oh, duh. Ta-da! Okay. <laughs> so this is your entire steel coa formation. But we have two primary rates, right? Uh-huh. So we're going to times that all by two. So let's make another little thing. What do we get out of acetyl CoA formation? What are our products? Two carbon dioxide. Perfect. And then two NADH. And then two acetyl CoA. Okay. Cool. Perfect. So do we get any ATP? No. Nope, not in this step. So we can add our two NADH, kind of keep a running tally of overall. So let's go up here and add 2 plus 2, and we'll make this a 4. 4. Okay. Because we want to see what we're bringing into the electron transport chain. Okay? So we got that. We well, can take away our pyruvate, uh, yeah. right? Because now that's used up. Instead, we're going to add our? 2 acetyl coli. Or acetyl. What are we, what mm -hmm. would it be? Acetyl coli. <laughs> And then what else do we get to add? Two carbon dioxide. Yep. Two CO2s. So here's what we've made so far out of our glucose molecule. Okay. 